Oklahoma and Nebraska. College football today from Lincoln, Nebraska's Memorial Stadium, the Big Eight shootout between these two offensive giants, number one ranked Oklahoma against number four ranked Nebraska. So it has to be an offensive show, you would think, this afternoon here in Lincoln. And hello again, everybody. I'm Keith Jackson. Right now, we're going to join the University of Nebraska band here on windswept Cole Memorial Stadium for our national anthem. of Lincoln and yell, go Big Red, you're safe, because I don't know who you're talking about, as long as you don't say Sooners or Huskers, then if you get that definite about it, you can get somebody after you. But it is a festive afternoon, and we get ready for the very important Big Eight Conference game, the important game nationally between Nebraska and Oklahoma right after this. Today from Memorial Stadium in Lincoln, Nebraska, Oklahoma and Nebraska. The Swift Sooners will be led by the great Billy Sims. Nebraska led by their tough running back Rick Burns at this ABC Sports Exclusive. This is what college football is all about. When you can get a couple of teams with those kind of numbers matched up close to the end of a season with so much more to come for each of them if there is to be success. Oklahoma first in both the major polls, Nebraska fourth in both the major polls, and over the last six years, the University of Nebraska Cornhuskers playing here at home, and when they start out of the tunnel, I think you will hear the whole middle of the country rattle a little bit, because here they come, and here's the sound. are an outstanding group of officials. So the two teams are now on the field. Von Schumann comes into this ball game, seven out of ten in field. Open first, I was amused by the two kickers in that game. Ani Vladikievsky, Tom Osborne, a man who has not beaten Oklahoma in the six years he's been here as the head coach. Third down and one, Sim. The first down and then some. Now. You don't think he's a runner? Oh my goodness! How many men did you think tried to tackle him? The win here in the first quarter. That was Switzer's plan. He moved around and he was a good seven, eight, maybe ten yards from him. 
scoreboard. Running corner. pass is still the most difficult play to defend in football, particularly with a back like Burns throwing. Well, the offensive lineman had given him the door. Andrew Blank and Keith is doing a good job blocking. It was almost expensive for them. All right, here that is very important on third down. Yep. He's got it. He's got a touchdown. Todd is on the field at 9.25 to go in the third quarter. To David Overstreet threw one good block to turn him upfield, and so Thomas Lott keeps the Now the football is just inside the 30. First down for the Sooners. Thomas Lott gives it to Billy Sims. He breaks it up the middle, and he is gone. Touchdown. His second of the day. Vincent. Fierce collisions. Looking for the coach. Because they gave up five yards on Barney Cotton having to put his shoe back on. Because on a 24 yard pass attempt. He's got it up. He's got it in the middle of the upright. And with 11 minutes and 51 seconds to play, Nebraska takes the lead 17 14, and they have broken a drought. They've scored for the first time in the fourth quarter against Oklahoma since 1971. But it's still wasn't. Here's the kick. It's Phelps. Oh, he almost stepped out. What Tom Osmond is asking is the other official to rule overrule. If one official didn't see it, Keith, you can't have another official overrule, and that's what they're screaming about. Phelps is still down on the field. Osborne to go for the tie. Even this late in the game. The pitch is outside the Sims. He runs through a tackle. He's down to the five-yard line. He fumbles. Nebraska's got the ball. Jim Pillen has the ball. it six times. They have the ball first and go to go inside the five as he was hit and went down. Sims coughed it up and little Jim Pillen was right there. Ten seconds to play. Tremendous football game. Final play of the ball game. Time is over. And the more than 76,000 people, I think all of them, want to come down on the field as the Nebraska Cornhuskers upset the top-ranked Oklahoma Sooners in a tremendous college football game by a score of 17 to 14. If you're pragmatic at all, you know full well nothing goes on forever. And the Nebraska Cornhuskers break the string against the Oklahoma Sooners as Tom Osborne brought a daring game plan to this ball game and exercised it and finally beat Oklahoma the first time in his career after six years at Nebraska that he has defeated an Oklahoma team. Rick Burns, the Chevrolet offensive player of the game. Jim Pillen, the Chevrolet defensive player of the game. And more NCAA football. Today's game between Oklahoma and Nebraska has been brought to you by Ryder Truck Rental, the best truck money can rent all east. By Pizza Hut, let yourself go for new super style. It's our new pizza that's more cheese, more toppings, more everything. So let yourself go to Pizza Hut. By the incredible Black and Decker and Workmate. There's almost nothing it won't hold. That's why when America has a job to do, it reaches for Black and Decker. And by Goodyear, maker of Tempo, snow tire, rain tire, sun tire, one tire you can drive with confidence all year. Once again, final score. Nebraska, 17, Oklahoma, 14.
travel arrangements made through, promotion will be paid by United Airlines. United, go the largest airline in the free world around you. This has been a presentation of ABC Sports, recognized around the world as the leader in sports television.